Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I know it's been uh, a, a bit, and I know it's uh, I've been busy, but um, welcome back to my videos. And today we will be talking about the Psychic Three. Let's see what it, the let's see what the design brings, and let's see um, all the different little uh, knickknacks and features on it. So let's talk about how the design came about. I mean look at the sleek design we will compare them later on in different videos to uh psychic lx and the psychic 2 just to see how uh they stack up very differently you see how it's not a very very thick phone it's got this silver and black colorway to it i believe they uh you can customize them of course they used to customize them back in the day and um, of course they came in this color and I'm not if I'm not mistaken they came in other colors as well but this one was the most uh, sought, sought out color so let's talk about it a little bit and let me show you some up close footage of it we don't see these very often anymore so it's always good to be able to see a psychic three show you the back well, it's a little worn out but hmm, it's uh 10 plus uh years or a year old phone so what can you expect let's take off the cover expose the battery incredible technology back in the day i mean 1.3 megapixel camera <laughs> So, uh, flash, obviously the, uh, the micro SD card, uh, and the SIM card right around here. Let's see, let's take off the battery. So here goes the micro SD SIM card and show you the back such a great design overall I mean it really was ahead of its time that's one of the things that throughout time uh, phones have only gotten better and better of course Let's see what milliamp is this Ooh, 1500 milliamp battery that was the you know, it, it held up pretty well that's for sure so very thin very very thin Here's the phone. Very, very nice phone. USB port. Also have your charger port. And here's the phone itself. Quarty uh, keyboard. Very, very nice phone. So it, and this is what it came with. Of course, it came with the charger itself, but simplicity that's one of the things that uh back then uh, you did not take for granted simplicity and how well things were made it still works great and it, it just it, very very well made phones back then they really were you could tell the craftsmanship and also how uh the technology that they used to pack back then into these phones so uh we're just gonna take a look at the at the phone for now and we'll go into some features and everything just in a tiny bit so uh
and then you kick it. <laughs> very, very well thought out uh, swivel design. Incredible how uh, they made this happen back then. Sure was ahead of its time. And also, I mean, you remember guys, this phone came out 12 plus years ago. Way more, it, it, it was a very, very retro phone. Uh, a lot of people loved it. And uh, it was the start of something very well thought out. It was the, the beginning of what we would like to call, it wasn't a touchscreen yet, but uh, it it first came, it first started with the swivel screen and then it and then it escalated from there. But smartphones had to start somewhere. <laughs> so uh, yeah, let me show you more of the phone. Power button, volume button. So it is not charged yet, but I'll show you the phone just for now and we'll do a more in-depth video of the, the phone itself. This was the scroll wheel. It really was an amazing phone. And until this day, I mean, what design compares to this? Just overall, it's it was just a very, very amazing phone when it came out. Not only was it very retro, it also did its job very well. It held up pretty well. And fun to look at. Well guys, I'm gonna end the video right here and uh, we'll keep talking about the uh, other phones very soon. I will keep you updated uh, on the channel. Please subscribe, comment below, and uh, let me know what videos you would like to see on different gadgets, old gadgets. So feel free to comment and like the video and um, please subscribe if you like the video and uh, I'll see you on the next one.